And coverage you can count on begins with local businesses serving the veterans who served our country. Tonight we're highlighting a few veteran owned businesses who had discounts available to any veterans who walked through the door. For Laziza's Mediterranean Grill, offering a 10% discount to veterans is something they do every Tuesday, but the offer on Veterans Day makes it extra special for employees. Today we get to offer it all day to all veterans. It's kind of a way of giving back to people that help create what we call a job. I have veterans in my family. Um, also, a lot of our customers are veterans or they're still active duty and a lot of them are repeat, so it's nice to get to know them and offer them something for their services. Veterans and active duty members could also get a free 16 ounce drink from Eubora Coffee Roasters. It means a great deal to co-owner Philip Weisner, a veteran himself. We always welcome military, military families to come in and sit down, have a cup of coffee, warm place to be when they come back in and say, hey, this is this is where I love to spend my time or where I catch up and call you guys. Uh, I want to share this with you. That that means a lot to us. Rally Point Grill was closed today as they usually are on Mondays, but for co-owners Tiffany and Kelly O'Neill, it's also a time of reflection. They recently lost a regular customer after he died in Hurricane Helene. Like the O'Neills, he was also a veteran. Spent time, you know, three, four days a week in here with us, a few hours of time, and and uh, brought a lot of his friends in here as well. Um, so we very much enjoyed having him him here with us and uh, the the camaraderie that he felt here with us. Every day is Veterans Day at Rally Point. You know, we serve everyone. Heroes are honored to include our first responders. So. Every day is a twist between Veterans Day, Memorial Day, and Patriots Day. Rally Point was closed today, as we mentioned, but they have specials for veterans throughout the week. We have more information on that on our website, wjbf.com.